fire and ice is showing on uche montana youtube channel do well to watch so this movie follows the story of a young girl it shows her resilience her persistence hard work her i don't go this spirit and how she overcame her situation let's talk cast. this is uche montana's first film as a producer he did really really pretty well for a first time producer she was very very careful being that she wanted to hit that one million mark it's effects for nollywood producers especially actors that became producers in that this is her first film she wanted to make sure that she hit that mark and what better way to do it was to make sure that her cast was carefully selected now when it comes to regina daniels there's no way this nollywood producer will tell me or directors will tell me they don't see that this girl's acting is mid her voice doesn't carry she doesn't have that aura she doesn't have that presence her facial expression is just very blank like she's empty when it comes to her performance they won't tell me that they don't see that the reason why uche cast regina daniels in the first place because she has the numbers daniels has 16.3 million followers if she posts that film at least bad as the bad one million people must see that film it's talent second then your influence on on social media first that's what they look at before they cast you for any, any film don't necessarily blame them because they need to break even at the end of the day not even break even they need to make profit at the end of the day you can still have two for two there are still actors that are as talented as they are influential because why was regina in this film especially being that she was playing the fiance to, to james gardner as if it's written in her contract you cannot hold regina for more than five seconds if i'm lying watch this film anytime then gardner put his hand on regina count how many seconds before he moves it have you seen fiances that are planning for their wedding this film is supposed to imitate life this movie failed woefully in doing that because of her choice of cast and she did this only because she wanted to make numbers forgetting the fact that she has obligation to her viewers being that it's her first movie we're going to give you the pass Watch Fire and Ice on the Montana TV. You know the fear? You won't kiss producer. You wear. <laughs> you know, his character here, yeah. the Montana has this weird thing that makes his co-stars look small. He makes them look incapable. When it comes to movie making, it's energy. Your co-star literally determines your performance. Which Montana now makes this boy look as if he didn't know what he was doing. He felt more like he was happy as opposed to them being in a relationship. His performance in this film, it was not impressive at all. Now, this film on its own, it was a good production. The cast members, they fell short. He played the fiancé to Regina. Daniel. We all know that has already gone wrong already. James Gardner on his own. Brilliant, beautiful, fantastic actor. Terrible. That they didn't give this man the opportunity to show his range. His co-star limited many things that he was supposed to do. You are getting married. He had to dial it down because he was in a scene with the billionaire's wife. You know the mad. <laughs> Is it written in the script that he lays hand on her lap for three minutes? Or it's out of his own discretion? Because it was so obvious that he was keeping his distance. Not just for Gina. Even when he was in scene with um, Uche Montana, he was just off. The chemistry was practically zero and it had nothing to do with him it's no news that i absolutely love and adore uche i'm going to tell you this out of love as a producer spectacular she, montana as the actress it's, she's getting on my nerves yes i get it you are the hbic no, nobody they follow you the dragon secondly yes we get it you are beautiful you are gorgeous you have that aura you, but i need to understand something you are literally acting it's make believe for a reason every woman is supposed to have pride it helps to prevent a lot of bs but time and place even when she is in scene you can still see that the pride is the lady that play her pa supposed to have a mutual beautiful relationship it didn't play out that way like i would need you to calm down and just get into character bring in uche the personality leave montana alone you could clearly see that it was montana that was in full effect and when it comes to your casting it's only when you're going to have a love interest cast the actors you're comfortable with the actors that you have a mutual understanding with this when people are saying she doesn't know how to act she knows how to act she just needs to pipe it down from nowhere this pride just jumps in. It throws everybody off and it makes it seem as if you're not doing enough. Act as natural as you can. Like it's really, really gets frustrating for how she continuously acts as if she's better than everyone in every scene. It makes no sense. Watch Fire and Ice on Montana TV it was actually nice. Thank you very much for watching. I truly do appreciate it. Peace.